quarter to kind of fourth quarter to kind of keep the lead. What surprised you more, that pass out hit you with or the baseline dunk? <laughs> I think both. <laughs> you know, um, Al knows the game, and um, it's been you know if you look at the, the guy in his draft in '98 and. Uh, and look at the guys that's not playing anymore, like Hollywood Candy and Al Harrington still playing out there. I mean, that's impressive. Uh, he's out there and not the best of health, but uh, he's at the one leg and still dunking the basketball, making plays like that. That's impressive. I mean. As you're making your way back, does the fact that you're playing with Andre, with Al, guys who've been around, does that help you in your uh, celebration? Well, definitely. I mean, it also gives me a little excuse if, uh, if I mess up on a play and Dre messes up on a play, you know, we're new. So uh, it's a little incentive right there. But uh, Andre uh, knows the game. And playing against him on opposing teams, always admired his game. And uh, now to have him on the same team and being in, in the game with him, I mean, it's great. It's great for me, and I'm happy. I'm happy he's on the team. What's it been like, though, just trying to adjust? You, you've been here a week and yeah. just trying to figure out what's going on. Well, we know. We always joke about how many teams I've been on. So, I mean, <laughs> this is not anything new to me about trying to <clears> – <throat> Transition, try to transition as quick as I have to in a short amount of time. Um, the, the good thing is that we're in a winning situation. And all, whatever it is for me to help this team you know, reach their goal, I'm going to do it. So whatever my role is, I'm accepted. And, uh, you know, and use that as, uh, to my full potential. Were you worried at all that there might not be more six degrees Drew Gooden? Um, no. Uh, the time off, you know, I had a lot of time to reflect on, on my career. And uh, having that much time off really touched your professionalism. You know, having to wake up on your own schedule and go work out. And what I found out away from the game is that I love this game. And that's what kept me going. And I knew once I ever had my opportunity again, I was going to sink, sink my teeth in any opportunity I got. You know, and I got to thank Ernie and Tommy Shepard uh, for letting me come in here and work out and giving me the opportunity. And I'm going to make the best of it. Anything you got Milwaukee coming up? I'm sure you saw the schedule already. Uh, the star, it's funny how the stars line up, huh? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, it was a tough situation for me last year there. Uh, more business than basketball, but uh, it is what it is. I'm, I'm, this is my situation right now. I'm making the best of it, and I, I hope to see Milwaukee coming up.